are you feeling about the season ahead? Yeah, I'm really excited too. I mean, so this is my junior season and I'm just ready to get playing with all my teammates and going on the bus rides like Courtney said and just having a great time. I mean, we're all having really good energy and I feel like we all get along super well. So we're just really ready to play someone else and have some good competition. I think both. Um, our leadership is amazing. I think we get they bring like fire. They're hard workers, and so I just think every person on our team is a hard worker like that. Like Coach Ravel said, we work day to day to just be the best we can each day. And I think when you have that mindset and mentality that you're not going to accept anything but the best, that you're just going to work hard. And having hardworking energy just brings it all together and creates that as a team. Yeah, it's been great. So yesterday, just the infielders went on the field and our cleats. And so that was super nice because we've been in indoors on the turf. And so I love just feeling the dirt finally. And since obviously we're going to be on dirt, dirt coming this weekend and every weekend after, like it's just super fun. We all just had a great time moving around. Like we're just going after everything we possibly can. And so it's just been really great. Yeah, um, there's a lot of goals, both personally and for the team. I would say that my personal goal is really to just do everything possible to help my team be successful and win. Um, another goal is, since I am a junior, I want to lead the team the best way I can, whether that's for the younger girls, where they can ask questions and just help learn. I'm a player that really likes to take every information or failure, whatever it is, and learn from it and grow from it, never just like, use it to make you mad or whatever. I always want to make it something that helps me get better. So I'd really like to put that on the younger ones and take everything that they go through to help them be better. Um, and so, yeah, I think our goals are very high. I'm going to kind of keep those to ourselves, but we all know what they are. We're all aligned to the same ones. And I think that's really special. Yeah, so I think definitely physically, obviously we have strengths, but I think one of the biggest strengths that we've grown is our mentality. And so when it comes to that, I think we've just realized that what goes on from the neck and above is one of the most important things when it comes to our game. So whether that's dealing with failure or even success, whatever it is, like knowing how you're going to go about that and how you can be the best competitor, how you can be aggressive, like how you can change the way you envision and think of things to be your best competitor. Um, I think having that mindset and practicing that on a daily basis, whether it's in practice, whether we're doing our um, competition against each other, just going hard and always having that mindset of like, nothing but that is good, um, has really grown our game. Coach said you and Billy Andrews on the left side, she put you up as one of the best duos on that side against anyone. Um, how is it playing alongside someone like it's amazing. I wouldn't want to play alongside anybody else. Billy is so awesome. We work together so good. I mean, no matter what it is, we're just always figuring out how to be better. Like, even though Coach Ravel said she thinks we're one of the best, like, we're always working on how we can get better and do even more awesome things. I mean, I just think the connection we have since day one, we're really lucky that we've been able to practice and play together since freshman year. Um, but yeah, I think our, our connection, when you have that connection off the field in practice and in the game, like that's what creates that really good side of the field. <laughs> and from the teammate perspective, like when Courtney announced that she was coming back, um, did you guys have an inkling or were you all surprised and was there like, messages going around like, oh, she's coming back. I don't, I mean, we, I guess we didn't know, but I don't think it was really a surprise. I mean, we, we know Courtney pretty well, and we knew she had a little bit more in the tank and really wanted to show that. Um, we also know how much she cares for us and wants to be there for us. And so I think once we saw that, we were just like, yes, like, here we go. We are ready. Like, we got Courtney back. Like, let's do this thing. Um, and so, 
yeah, we were just so blessed and grateful to have her back and just was ready for another year to have her lead us and take us to places that we want to go.